But when this came along, and your first day on set, and I've told this story before, so forgive me, but um, that Bentley, like the scene with the Bentley, you know, when Catch is finally revealed, and they're like, here's your car, $500,000 Bentley. It's like, and they're like, don't touch. They're like, we will drive it for you, and then you will get out. And uh, every so, all of a sudden, every one of my characters is a little bit Italian. I don't know, it's a sort of Romans guy getting into it. Um, and then the guy with the, 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 what's called the Weapon Wrangler comes up to me, and he goes, and uh, this is a practical grenade launcher. You're going to have a full charge. I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, there's the little boy in you that loved watching James Bond and like all these action movies is just coming out of you. And uh, Phil Segrita, who is uh, was the director and executive producer on the show, he's just I don't know if he's like I don't know if he does interviews or do you know who he is? Have you like seen him and do stuff? He is still so twelve years into the show, so excited and such a, like a like a big gentle teddy bear of a nerd as well. And to have a guy who's been doing this show for 12 seasons just be like, oh, this is going to be fun, we're going to have fun today. We're going to have fun today. You know, like, oh yeah, we're going to blow that up. And, uh, and you know, when you, when you get to show up and collaborate with people who are still having so much fun on the show, I think that's why you still like the show, because you can sort of sense that energy in the show. Like I was talking to Jared and Jensen too, it's like, they're still like, we're pumped. They're, we still haven't finished telling stories yet, so, uh, you know, I'm living the dream, uh, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, they're like, Dave was really uh, passive aggressive in this panel, trying to uh, elucidate too much uh, empathy for him. What a sad sack. Uh, no, but, it, but it's kind of true, so it, it's nice, it's a, it's a kind of a, Adam and I were talking about it too, because obviously we all know we have, a, have an Adam Ferguson. Um, yeah, twat. I think it's a proper pronunciation of that. Um, <laughs> but we, I, we kind of talked about it before, like, you see, you, you, I mean, you get sad to see a character die on screen. The actors are really sad to see their character die on screen. You're like, off I go to the unemployment line. You know, you're just like, you know, I gotta go back and start selling the wares and, and looking for my new dream job. So any job for an actor, I like to call it, that's your current dream job. So just be grateful, investigate it, lean into it, and, uh, but man, I am so grateful for Catch, and so grateful that you guys care or are interested a little bit. So thank you.